What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Nima. So today I'm gonna to be trying out the new sister brand to Oma Beauty, Oma by Sharon C. This is a more affordable, clean, eco-friendly brand. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys some of the new stuff that just came out. I also love the fact that it is a drugstore friendly brand. It's actually exclusively at Walmart. They are sponsoring today's video. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys everything that has launched with them recently. They also have this like five minute face challenge. So I'm gonna be trying that as well today. I'm not gonna claim to do it under five minutes because you guys still want the information and giving you guys info and a five minute face is gonna be very tricky. So I'm just gonna show you guys the products that I use for the five minute face, but just know that I do think that I could have gotten it done in five minutes. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. Go from here to here in supposedly five minutes. So the first thing I'm gonna be using is the Supra Natural Glow Vitamin C Serum. They launched with two different types of this serum. There's a 10% vitamin C, and then there's a 20% vitamin C. And the 10% is supposed to be for all skin types, um, and the 20% is for a more advanced, more, more potent formula. So I've been using the 20% just because I'm that type of person, I'm like all or nothing. Um, I don't have anything on my face right now except like a facial mist. I'll also go ahead and show you guys everything that I have um, on my little mini table here. I actually was watching a video the other day and it was from like some doctor, some dermatologist, and they were like, they were basically saying like, oh, if you feel overwhelmed with skincare, if there's anything that you should keep in, within your skincare routine is a vitamin C serum. And I was like, hmm. That kind of makes sense though, because vitamin C does so much. With everything else that's in here too, it also has vitamin E and vitamin B3 and vitamin PP. But I've heard and I know that vitamin C does a lot for you. So for the sake of the fact that this is a five minute face, I'm gonna try and move through this. I'm gonna use the Charlotte Tilbury Magic Night Cream because this is a thicker moisturizer. You guys know I have dry skin. And the foundation that I'm gonna be using today from them is more for, it says specifically if you have dry skin, to use an oil-based primer. And I'm not using an oil-based primer today. I'm just gonna use, I'm just gonna go really good on my skincare. And it's looking good. I had a facial the other day, and my skin was not happy about it. It was my first time doing microdermabrasion. It took a moment for my skin to be like, okay, okay, okay. But it was really good. My skin looks really good right now. It just needed um, to get used to it. Then we're gonna finish that off. Of course, we have to use sunscreen. I need a little sunscreen. So that is how we're looking. Finally, it's really warm in here. These lights don't play with my soul, you guys. They don't. They're always trying to come for me. But this is how it's looking, looks really good so far. The vitamin C didn't really ball up because um, I didn't use too much. They, they specifically said to not use too much or it will tend to ball up a little bit, but that's okay because I think if it does what it needs to do with less product, then you're saving money, so that's fine with me. For a little bit more of an added glow effect, I am gonna use my MAC strobe cream just because I know I'm going with a very light face today. I'm doing a very light chill face today. This strobe cream I am obsessed with. It gives you such a nice glow. All right, I think we're ready. I think we're ready for the foundation. So this is the Flawless In Real Life Skin Perfecting Foundation. This is what it looks like. Um, I actually really like the packaging. At first when this brand launched, um, I thought that it was just like new products that were coming to Alma Beauty. I didn't know that it was a completely different sister brand because the packaging is so close to Alma Beauty's packaging. But the fact that it's only available in Walmart and almabysharonc.com makes sense. Oh, my skin looks so good right now. Mm, mm, mm. Looks so good. Okay. This foundation comes in 30 shades and in six different formulas. Remember when Oma Beauty first launched, they specifically had different formulas for different skin tones. So this is what the foundation looks like. I'm gonna go ahead and use a sponge. I don't know, I'm just gonna start to blend that in. And this is technically considered a BB cream. Um, BB creams have a little bit more coverage than, oh, I'm so glad. I am so glad that I went heavy on the moisturizer. 
because now it is gonna give you the perfect, now it's gonna give me the perfect like skin, your skin but better or your skin glow. Cause it definitely is more of a, I don't wanna say a matte finish, it's more of a natural finish, but the way that it dries down, definitely dries down more, not as dewy, so it's a BB cream. It's not a tinted moisturizer, it's not a skin tint. It's gonna give you a lot more coverage than those two types of products. I think I used two, two pumps so far. And I'm focusing mainly on the center of my face and then I blend it out. But yes, two pumps so far. I don't even need concealer. I thought I was gonna need concealer, but it's doing a pretty good job. Um, for a five minute face, I don't really can care to overly conceal my under eyes as long as they look somewhat balanced and somewhat in between. So I don't even feel like I need to do that. So I probably won't. Feels really lightweight. I feel like I'm wearing too much. This is nice. A little bit of contour for some dimension. I'm gonna use my MAC um, contour palette. You guys have seen me use this a lot. And then next we have the, it's complicated. This is a lip oil, a lip tint, and a lip gloss. So you can use it in multiple different ways. I'm gonna use it today as a blush, and then I'm gonna use a different color as a lip product. So the shade that I'm using for blush is called Classy, and it's this bright red. I think it's gonna show up really nice on my, on my skin tone. It's pretty it's just like a nice little flush and for it to be a lip oil and a lip tint and do all of that I was expecting it to be a little bit too glossy on my face but I kind of like I really like the way that this looks oh that's pretty I always take my blush on my nose you guys know that I love that it's not too much it's like it's there, but it's not there. It's like not doing too much at all. All right, so I just gave my brows a quick little fill-in, so I'm gonna go ahead and jump to the next product. This is the mascara. Oma Beauty actually has one of my favorite mascara formulas, um, but I think this one is different. It's, a diff it's not the exact same one as the one they launched it before. This is the Batter Boom Mascara. It is a volumizing mascara. Now I have tiny lashes. And you guys already know that about me. My five minute look, usually I pass on the mascara just because I don't think I need it like that. And um, if I do, then I just go in really, really heavy on the mascara. I think I'm gonna leave my bottom lashes clean today. I don't know, I've just kind of been liking that look. I'm gonna leave them clean. And then for lips, I think this is gonna look good. Let's try and find what color is gonna look good with my dress today. Ooh. Yeah, that's the one. All right, so this is the shade Softy. And this is the, it's complicated lip oil tint and gloss that I was show, that I put on my cheeks earlier. This is a little lighter than I thought it was gonna be. There's actually this color, let me try that. This looks really good though. I'm gonna put this on the outside of my lips. This is the shade Peng. Ooh, this is really pretty. It's kind of doing this like little ombre effect. I like that. Okay, I look like I really did something. I think it's the lips though. The lips really kind of made it seem like I did something. It's also really lightweight. It feels really good on the lips. I am so glad to see a brand like this that is clean beauty, eco-friendly, is affordable, and it works on deeper skin tones, which is so hard to find. First of all, trying to find clean beauty for deeper skin tones is a whole nother thing. I talked about that a little bit on my Ami Cole video. And it's, a, it's accessible in Walmart stores, like in-store is really amazing. So congratulations, Sharon. This looks so good. Five minute face, darling. Okay, I mean, besides my brows, but my brows are always gonna take forever for me. You guys know that. 
But besides my brows, alrighty guys, so that is pretty much it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are excited to try these out, let me know which product you're the most excited to try out. Thank you again to Oma Beauty for sponsoring today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Lots of love, and I will see you guys next time.